Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to the video. I'm gonna be talking like this because one of my neighbors was cutting the grass. Um, but anyways, um, I'm focusing right now because obviously in the past, in the last video I did um, like high reps and kind of like uncontrolled. But obviously in the title of the video, it's controlling the damn weight because obviously I need to focus on the way my form is. And then I want to prepare myself for obviously the end of the video, which is going to be, I believe, 185. So 185 pounds. Um, oh yeah, right here I added 20, yeah, 20 more pounds. So 25, 25, and then 10 and 10. Um, again, I'm trying to focus on my posture. Look right there. The freaking gnats are bothering me. Um, all the damn flies. It's super hot also. Like, I, I, I did want to like give up. I was like... I was like, damn, the the dude's cutting the grass. The audio is going to be annoying. And then the flyers are going to be in my way. But I, and then I, I got inside and I was like, I was like, crap, like I'm making up all these damn excuses. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to just go for it. I got a little fresh air inside and then I and then I hit the squats again. Um, and for some reason, it, do, it does feel good to like actually like kind of like let out energy in a way like. Like, let's say I'm all, like, making excuses, I'm all tired, and then the adrenaline rush from, from what I get from working out, it, like, gives me, a, like, a like a boost. Um, so it does help out, like, um, also with my, my, my energy, my energy, my mood, um, everything, honestly. Um, but, yeah, so the, the one that I did before which was the 25, 25, and then 10 and 10, I I thought to myself, I was like, you know what? Let me just uh, fix it 35. Cause I was like, I'm gonna just get rid of the the tens. I just put 35, 35 on each side right here. Um, and again, same thing. Just going slow, preparing for the 185. Um, and Try to also put oxygen in my damn brain because every time I squat, well not every time, but when I squat, I tend to like get like lack of oxygen in my brain and then I'm like, oh crap, I can't I can't go another another rep. But um but yeah man, I, I need to just continue putting oxygen in my brain, trying to focus on my breathing. And that's a that's another thing about um doing squats yes you could do like high high reps and and just go for it without any um like form which is sometimes in a in a, in a way like good because it prepares you for like the real world you know like oh just just do it randomly rather than focusing on the on the form right but for this one obviously it's gonna prepare me for like the heavier weights because it's getting it's it's basically targeting the muscles and it's saying like hey wake up you know, it's kind of like a slow pinch to the to the muscle. Um, the the muscle starts tearing, everything starts waking up. Um, and right there, look right there, I'm doing jumps, right? So I'm I'm jumping, I'm getting ready for, I believe the other set that I'm gonna do, which is another twenty pounds added. But I'm putting myself um, kind of to failure, but at the same time, knowing that like, okay, I'm not gonna go that far like right now. Because obviously, when I'm gonna go to failure is when I hit the 185, right? Um, but yeah, I'm just I'm just getting my mind ready, trying to trying to fix my form. Right there, I'm literally tired. <laughs> I told myself I was uh, in my head. I was telling myself I'm like, damn, uh, do I go another rep? But I was like, you know what? I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna doing like kind of like a like a do an extra mile type of thing. So I squatted. Did like some, uh, I actually did in this video, I did a lot of pause squats. So pause squat, face my form, and then jump. So it's helping me out too, too. It, uh, I kind of started there, but it's also helping me out to get ready for the 185. Because the 185, I'm not going to be jumping. I'm just going to be doing regular squats. But it kind of puts me in the mindset of like, oh, look, I'm going to squat heavy, you know. Um... So right here, I'm doing the same thing, slow, 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 
trying to focus on my breathing and like I get like I said with the oxygen and the the spine um, trying to focus also on targeting the way I lift myself because usually when I lift myself I tend to use my back right like obviously that's like a normal thing to to like use like obviously your legs obviously your back but what I'm trying to focus on is using my more of my legs because later in the video you're going to see that I use my arms for assistance because obviously my legs are um, like completely drained and tired um, but yeah just trying to focus on using my legs more um, not not more of my back but yeah more of my legs um, right here I was kind of dizzy I was like crap like I need to breathe relax get that oxygen back in and and keep going because I, I know I know myself when or I, I know when I'm gonna like yeah yeah it's completely done like I should stop but knowing myself I, I, I know that like okay I can all I have to do is relax put some oxygen and I just keep getting the rep um, but yeah like right there you see how you see how like I I already like what's that word like kind of, kind of like calibrated myself, um, kind of like told myself in the head I was like okay relax you know so I I fix my posture I fix my legs I try to focus on uh, the next rep trying to focus on the same thing because I'm tempted and like again I'm tempted to go fast but no control the weight you could do this the next one is gonna be one yeah one. 65 and the same thing the same thing bro like um just going slow right there i was like looking at my knees i was like are my legs right but anyways i did uh, another pause squat I'm trying to focus on focusing on my legs pushing up not not merely my spine but my legs oh and also another thing i have to or you have to like realize is the the amount of time you say standing Cause like yeah like obviously like if you stay standing for like five minutes with the weight on your spine it's obviously gonna hurt and it's gonna tire you out but what i'm trying to um, do there is once i get up i obviously try to get like enough enough oxygen as i can and and then squat like right away because i don't want to spend too much time just standing um like again i want to focus on kind of like uh what the muscle does is like tears so i want to like tear the muscle and then obviously with the food I repair it, but like right there, just working out, trying to balance, trying to tear the muscle, trying to prepare myself for the 185. Getting my mind right. Look at that. I'm getting all I'm like biting my damn <laughs> biting my damn lip because I know um I gotta add another weight. So right there is 165. Wait. Yeah, 165. And then just I know my I, I know. What's coming next is the 185. So I, I did forget how many reps I did, but so I did like low reps, just getting ready for the 185. So this is 185. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you guys enjoy the raw footage. <clears throat> Ah! <sighs> 
这这这！妈的！Well, damn me, right? I even I was getting tense just watching that. Um, <laughs> um. Anyways, the next workout. Oh my god, why am I so excited? The next workout is gonna be working out the vascus medallius, whatever the hell it's called. Um, basically the inner thigh. Um, the reason I was doing this is because the amount of force you have to be putting into the bicycle um triggers the muscle so i love tearing this muscle because it's kind of like a um, it kind of like makes the thigh look big so it's another reason why i like it. um but yeah so just working out the bicycle but as fast as i can here trying to max out the last time i did this i did kind of like get tired and basically vomit um but that's the only reason the only reason I, that happened was because i didn't eat but it's whatever whatever so yeah and then i'm gonna be working out the um, calves five maybe five six reps um honestly i don't like working out calves but i basically already worked out the calves doing um uh, jump squats and deadlifts whatever um but yeah and also um i didn't put this in the video but the recovery for the or the food that i did use for recovery is um uh, chicken breast and some cucumber and onions i believe yeah onions um and then lemon with water and a bit of honey but yeah guys thank you guys for watching the video to the end uh make sure to like the comment i mean make sure to like the video um <laughs> and comment what i should do next or what bodybuilder i should um train next because the other video was or these two videos were mike menser um related so yeah have a good day and have a wonderful life peace